Civil War. Oh. Rashida Tlaib versus Sri Thanedar. Yeah, go ahead. I'll, I'll wait. I'll just light this cigarette. Okay. <laughs> Detroit, two congressmen. People. Congress folk. Right? They can't. They stand for so little that they don't know what to say when something like a terrorist attack mm. from Hamas butchers over a thousand people mm. and then the Israelis respond and innocent people die in air raids, right? They don't know what to say. They don't realize that they live in a multicultural place. Yep. Metro Detroit, 250,000 Muslims, 100,000 Jews, 160,000 Chaldeans. Right? Plus the Christians, plus the Hindus, plus the Buddhists, the Baptists. You know what I'm saying? This is a real place. The Hmong. We got a large Hmong community here, too. This is unbelievable. Mm -hmm. And so Rashida Tlaib cannot say she condemns a terror attack by Hamas that kills innocent people in their sleep. Right? In fact, I don't know why... Joe Biden's going over there and getting in the middle of this thing like like he did with the UAW strike. That's not working out good, Joe. You got to you got to look like something, Joe. But a missile, a shell, something falls on um a Baptist hospital in Gaza and immediately Gaza uh, the Hamas puts out that it's an Israeli shell. Now, it's starting to maybe look like it it, it, it could be a Hamas shell that went bad because there's no crater there right it mm -hmm. just looks like the accelerant lit on fire and burned everything up but that didn't stop Rashida Tlaib right after she's hiding when she starts getting ripped by the press like you can't condemn terrorism she tweets because she's looking for it she tweets Israel just bombed the Baptist hospital killing 500 Palestinians doctors children's patients just like that POTUS, President of the United States, this is what happens when you refuse to facilitate a ceasefire and help de-escalate. Your war and destruction only approach has opened my eyes and many Palestinian American and Muslim Americans like me. See that pandering? It didn't open Jewish eyes or Gentile eyes. You know what I mean? We will remember where you stood. Here she is lathering up a crowd. I love how she can turn on the tears. People think it's okay to bomb a hospital mm. with children. <laughs> you know what's so hard sometimes is watching those videos and, and the people telling the kids don't cry and like let them cry. And they're shaking and somebody, you know this, they keep telling them not to cry in Arabic. <laughs> they, do, they can cry. I can cry. We all can cry. To my president, to our president. Yes, he still are. Well, hold on. I know. I, hey, I want him to know, as a Palestinian American, is also somebody of Muslim faith. I'm not going to forget this. Oh, is that a threat? Wow. You said, oh, what do you, how, do you, what, how do you read that? <laughs> Pretty aggressive. I mean, along with her tweet, too. Then a bunch of people went into the rotunda and took it over. Like, like right after that. A couple Pretty of quick. Three people are charged with, like, you know, abuse on a cop. Okay, everybody's starting to pull the same little trick, aren't they, now? I, I, don't, I, don't, I don't like this leadership. Nobody's leading. No Why wouldn't she say to this multicultural society that she represents, everybody be cool, let's see what's going on? Because... If it's shown and it's starting to look like it, I don't know. But if it was Hamas's shell, then what? You condemning them? Yeah. What's going on here? Yeah. I don't know. And I'm, as a public figure, try to be careful, Dana. Uh -huh. Okay? All I know about Rashida, I've known her since I got here in 2008. All I can say is I know you're an opportunist. I know you cheated on your property taxes three times. You didn't pay back the city of Detroit. And your own father called me to call you a scam. That's what I know. So start leading. You did nothing in this town. Those demolition holes are full of poison. You didn't do anything. Right? That's environmental racism perpetrated by Democrats 
and you didn't do anything. And yes, Mayor, there will be some more federal stuff being announced, I'm told, by some federal sort of people. Federal sort of people. Yeah, you <laughs> make it go away, statue of limitations, the whole nine yards. You know what I hear a lot? Charlie LeDuc Newsman, I thought you were dead. I'm not dead. I'm doing the news, the real news, right here, the No BS News Hour. You can find us on YouTube, you can find us on Facebook, Odyssey, or download it wherever you get your podcasts. Power the people.